Hello, men, women, and assorters, and welcome back to Let's Play Subnautica. Last episode, we were continuing our construction of our base, you know, helping filling it out, getting the first story completed, and had a hell of a time trying to find lead. The game wanted to troll us hard with that, but we found it in the end, and now the base is starting to come together significantly. Uh, what we're going to do now is just gather a few more resources to finish that medkit fabricator. And I'll we'll probably actually want to grab some... No, that's right, that broke. Well, not broke, it ran out of power. Come here, fish. But yeah, I gathered some more resources and after yeah. that... We'll see about building ourselves a sea moth. Quartz. There's more quartz in here. I think we might need that. Copper is something we definitely need. Holy Quartz City Central. That's just quartz, but everything's here. Collect all the things! All the things belong to me! I'm going to start moving resources over from our uh, pod shortly, too. Holy, there's our inventory space. That's an infected stalker. Come here. Bad stalker. Got ourselves some salt, so let's head back to the base. I need to make myself a computer ship. Along with some food, water, whatever else I can come up with. I don't think we need to make... Well, we might... We're gonna need some glass for the thing with Bob. Need some table coal. I'll make that in a minute. Dump that in the supplies locker. Here. Sure integrity has been lowered again. Whatever. What else do I want to uh, in here? Yeah, let's just dump. I'll organize this better later. But let's just dump some raw resources in here for now. I need actually some gold. I also need fiber mesh, if I'm not mistaken, along with you. Boom and boom. Let's start swimming back to the, uh... Let's... Got extra batteries, might as well use them. Not extra, but we can switch battery between things to make this a little faster. And then just start packing up material from the life pod and moving them over to our new base. Yeah, I can to hopefully 
actually initiate a movement today. And then after that, if we have time, might see if we can track down the last life pod that we had, life pod six, which only have a rough estimate of its location rather than just straight up signal. So close to being able to get everything in one go. Supplies have been gathered. Head back to the base. I do want to. Ex well, I need to actually get. I need to build some more reinforcements or something. Increase hole integrity before I can expand the base further. But I do want to. Uh, Extend that one passage down a little bit and from one of the offshoots build the scanner room. And maybe build some other stuff off of that from later. But like I said, we need more structural integrity before we can do anything of that sort. Now I need to free space. go. Now we can build you. Now we have a med kit fabricator. And let's actually go ahead and build ourselves the mobile vehicle bay now, which we will need in the future to construct the Seamoth. What else do we need for the Seamoth, actually? Uh... No, we need a titanium ingot. Need more glass, need lead. Got lead. Okay. Make another thing of glass right now. We just need a power cell and a titanium ingot. How much copper do we have? Enough. Get some mushrooms and another thing. I also need at least one more thing of titanium. Stay away. Come here, you. I want you for lunch. That. Now I just need titanium. A thing of titanium. That will do. Boom. Okay, let's get back to the base and refine this stuff. Ooh, another broadcast. What's on the radio this time? in light pod 19 the captain Keen. is gone i have assumed command the last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land we regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site stay together and good luck this message will now repeat rendezvous coordinates corrupted transmission uh. origin coordinates downloaded signal location uploaded to peter okay so 
Yeah, we don't have the rendezvous coordinates, but we do have where the key went down, so another life pod to investigate. Hooray! So we've got something to do after we get the seam off done. So now we've got two life pods to find. Got our titanium ingot. Now to just make ourselves the batter, the power cell. And some dinner. Another lab, lag spike. Alright. That, I think we've got about everything. And we're just charging batteries at this point. At least the mobile vehicle bay. One second, I forgot my keys. Might as well be keep constantly charging batteries. And let us release. And ascend to the surface. And from here, we can build ourselves our sea moth. Another so achievement. But remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. I've been swimming all day since I got here. I think a submarine would be very nice to have. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yep. Inbuilt thermometer. Lights. For good. Power cell. I like. Now you notice on the top of the screen we have that 200 in yellow. That's our crush depth. Basically, we go below that, we're going to start having problems. And let's actually go ahead and grab this to make sure it doesn't float away or something. I said grab it, not climb on board of it. But yeah, we are living nicely now. I'll just stick you in here. Along with you. Start charging you, and I can put you away in here for now. I don't really need the habitat builder on me at this moment in time. Alright. Let's go back and... Six transmission orbs engine. Sunk to approximately 100 meters, located in the area of Red Crash. 400 meters west northwest of Life Pod 4's last known location. We don't know where Life Pod 4 is. That's the problem. We know it's in a red area. And that's about all we got. Well, it's something at the very least. actually catch another boomerang or something. You'll do. And we'll head out. We are near a red area, so let's start exploring this and see what we find. And while we're doing that, we can start making our way towards Keen's life pod. So let us go. Onwards! To exploration and search and rescue. Sorry, fish. Do we search that thing? Will that part of the wreckage? I think we might have. Yeah, it's a thing that needs the laser cutter to cut through. Let's just continue our exploration. Dense red grass or natural arches. Uh, 
That's a sea moth fragment. That's a vending machine. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency it's fine, I can replenish oxygen in the sea moth. Now we know how to make a vending machine now. <laughs> hey, you gotta have some creature comforts. Battle of your face versus my ship, I'm gonna win this fight. Hmm. Where are you, life pod? Don't want to stray too far from the red area. Because I don't want to be going off course. That looks to be very deep down. Probably not where I'm supposed to be looking either. You yeah, can't see much of anything down there. Going down there would blow through my crush depth, so nope. Big fat nope. That direction is where it sunk to 300 meters just to pop Keen's life below my crush depth. We can get upgrades to improve our crush depth, but we currently don't have those upgrades. Is there anything useful down here? Ooh, I see some special rocks. Passing 100 meters. Shale. Oxygen what in the hell? Remember Hi, the Diamond. You gather are the property. Of the All Terra Corporation. Of course, you now you tell me that. To reimburse the full market price. Your current bill stands at three million credits. Three million credit? Oh, screw you! I'll take my laser cutter when you're done with it. What that? You got a ruby? Ruby? A, a, a ruby? Gold, lithium, and diamonds. Ooh. We got one of our diamonds, one more, and we can make ourselves the laser cutter we so wish. There was something down there. What's that? What are these? Oh, we turned around over right there. Oh, that's limestone. That's something that's affected. Where was that thing I saw? There's a thing. You're a knight! Good thing I have a ra rat suit. Don't want to start peeing green. Another ruby down there. Highly radioactive material. No duh. Application in nuclear power. Yeah, I think we're done enough exploring that cave. Get out of creepy cave and keep looking for more thing about. As you can see, this thing can't go too deep right now. It's our base, which we can see through on the horizon. Okay. Apparently this thing has x-ray vision. Come on, life pod six, where are you? West, north, west of Life Pod 5, but we don't, or Life Pod 4. I don't know where Life Pod 4 is, though, so that's the problem. And there's where Keen's Pod is. 
giant craggy fields. About 100 meters down. Okay, that's actually a pretty good clue. For about 100 meters down, that's where we go a bit. I gotta run you. Something snacked my ship. Ass. Grading that bring more repair tool now. About 100 meters, so we should be looking at this depth. Okay, textures are going nuts. Come on, life pod, where are you? have like homing beacons or something. That's life pod 17. We've already found you. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Scanner room fragment. We've already got the scanner room. Seamoth fragment. I came here in a Seamoth. Don't really have much in the way of tools, but... What is that bioreactor fragment? Meh. That's a bioreactor, yep. What's that down there? Battery chart. Finding all the things we have already. Is there an entrance to this? That is my question. Sparking. Aha! Hole breach. Stay away. You know, I think that thing would be doing more in Sergeanton Water, but whatever. The PDA. True manifest with the Gassi. The hell is a Gassi? Terran search and rescue mission. Ooh, bench. Easily distracted. New blueprint acquired. Sea moth. Some fresh air. Stop bogging on my mop! To see if there's another entrance on this thing other than what I found. Breach in this massive ship, wreckage of a ship. Stay away. Why were you just tucked in that corner? You know what? Never mind. I don't want to know. Looks like I've explored about all I can from this thing, so. Put a red helmet back on. Keep exploration. Come on, life pod, where are you? Other hole in the ground.
Yeah, that's the border where we want to go. Okay. Everything right now. Yeah, probably want to start heading back and around or something. Talk about a poppin'. I think you can see something like that from much farther away. Yeah, also avoid the obvious rocket placements. That revolves around my piloting skills, which is an entirely different question. Increasing our altitude a bit, or not altitude, depth, but decreasing our depth. I don't, I don't know the word for it. Ah, open the door. Come on, put your back into it. Ah, I need a laser cutter. Oh, water though, that's good. Ow. <laughs> More water. Even here. What the? Ooh. New area. What's that? I don't want to know. Gone too far again. Okay. Where are you, life pod six? I want to help you, but you're not being very helpful with your location. It looks like I found a new area. So underwater mushroom trees. Biology. We had the point of reference for Life Pod 4 without having any idea where Life Pod 4 is. I think we would have found that one first. Ow! What the hell just hit me now? Stop breaking my ship, I just got this. I'm calling the expedition here. I don't think we're finding much of anything. We'll put 30 minutes now, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna go back to base, and next episode we start 
Not sure what I'm going to do, honestly. Investigate Keen's uh, broadcast, even though it is pretty deep. We'll see. We'll see what we can build, see what we've got, you know. We shall see. But until next time, I'm going to go some later. Pick a controller and have a good time. Peace out, people.